In this video I'm showing how to descale an Espresso over 2O+. When I hit the brew button you can see that the lights on the top turn red and green. The red and green light is the machine's descaling alarm. Descaling is a cleaning routine that the machine runs through to clean out any minerals from the water that have built up on the machine's internals. The descaling process is fairly easy but it is time consuming so I'm going to run through the steps as quickly and as simply as possible. To start, lift up the lever so that if there's a capsule in place, it gets ejected. Then once the capsule is ejected, just push the lever back down to close the machine. Then hold down on the lever for about 3 seconds to power the machine off. Next you'll need the descaling solution. I got a 2 pack of this, you can get it from either Nespresso's site or from Amazon, I'll leave a link in the description. There's not a lot to it, it's just this tube of cleaning solution. Just snip the corner on one of the bags and pour it into a full tank of water. The next step is to enter the special functions menu. That's done by pressing and holding both the lever and the brew button at the same time for about 3 seconds. If you did it right, you should get this steady orange light. Then press down on the lever once to enter descaling mode. And at this point, the orange light begins blinking. For this next step, you might need to remove the cup holder. Then you'll have to put a large container in place to catch the water and descaling solution as it comes out of the spout. Now press the brew button one time and the machine will begin descaling. This phase takes a while and the machine kind of goes on autopilot and doesn't really need any input from us, so there's no need to babysit it. It'll start and stop and make a bunch of weird sounds, and eventually it will run through the entire cleaning solution in the tank. Your mileage may vary, but this took 22 minutes to complete on my machine. I'm going to go ahead and fast forward to the end. Once it's finished, the light should still be blinking orange and the tank should be empty. You can go ahead and dump whatever you use to catch the water. Then, remove the tank and wash it thoroughly to clean out any of the remaining descaling solution. Fill the tank with clean water and reattach it to the machine. Press the brew button one time and the machine will begin the rinse phase. And make sure you have your container in place because it's going to run through the whole tank again. And again, take a break and go do something else. The rinse phase was a little bit faster, but it took about 10 minutes for mine to complete. Alright, so at this point you are almost finished. Go ahead and dump the water from the rinse cycle, you won't be needing that anymore. Now press down on the lever and brew button at the same time for about 3 seconds to exit descaling mode. At this point the light should change to blinking green, and you're done. The instructions indicate you should let the machine rest for 10 minutes before trying to brew anything. After this endeavor, a beer is a more appropriate beverage anyways, so go ahead and press down on the lever for 3 seconds to turn the machine off. Well my friends, that is the end of the story. That is the descaling process on the Nespresso Vertua Plus. Hit like if this video helped you out, and thanks for watching.